Hello YouTube, this is my FT007 boat with the water cooling system I just installed. I have a video on how to do it by yourself, it's uh, not really complicated. So here's the intake, you see I have the tubing with the 45 degree angle uh, cutting uh, so the water can, by the brush pressure when it's moving, get inside of the tubing, go around the coil and exit just in the side of the boat um, as of course you can trim uh, the exit right here it's uh, kind of big the tubing um, I drill uh, exactly with the six millimeter uh, drill and uh, didn't place any hot glue yet to fix in place I don't think in this way we're gonna have water getting inside of the boat but although uh, it seems to be safe I will uh, put some glue in there. So just the coil here weighting them. It's uh, about 25 uh, grams additional weight that you need to to place in there. So hope the boat can uh, really uh, work with that. In the in the side right there, you see the small blue plastic tubing uh, that is connected to the copper tubing around the motor. And um, in the bottom, you have this intake with the 45 degrees. See that uh, drill exactly with the same uh, size, it is getting there uh, with a lot of pressure. So, I don't think I need to place some glue there, but I, I will do it just to make sure it's, it's safe. So, uh, now I'm just gonna turn it on and uh, hope you guys like it, this video and I have a video on how I bend this uh, tubing using my hands how I trim the housing for the motor uh, to make it uh, feasible thank you guys hope you guys like it and hope it helps will help the boat to keep the motor in, in a clear condition and you can run uh, several batteries through it without burning up the motor, okay? Thank you guys, bye.